I don't... What? Why does everything keep happening to us? It's a great question. I don't know. I don't have an answer for that. The cosmic humor? Yeah, maybe the uh, other astrals you know of. Maybe some of them that don't like us are playing a little trick. I don't know if they're playing any little tricks on this. I don't know. Or the way that we're thinking of it anyways. Maybe it's because he's not from this dimension. They got rid of him. I don't I don't know if it's a cosmic thing or if it's just bad luck. Why'd it happen? Um... <sighs> Ruin didn't like the thing called the Creator Council. Well, because of that, he kind of just decided any creator a part of the council should be eliminated along with their dimension to stop the chance of there being more. So he killed Solar because of that? Solar was a byproduct of his plan. Yeah. He didn't target Solar, just... According to him, if he could, he wouldn't have killed Solar. Whether or not I believe that's a different story. Him. I just wish bad things would stop happening to us. Me too. I think we all do, Leonard. I'm gonna do everything I can. I know. Where is Earth at? Monty's place, I think. Monty just dropped me off here. Uh, Gator Golf? I don't, I don't know if it's Gator Golf or if it's their house or what. Monty just dropped me off here because he wanted to take Earth because Earth kind of broke down. You mean like physically? Or no, mentally. Yeah, I uh wasn't the prettiest sight. Um. Hmm. I, I believe it. Okay. Um. Is there anything you need? I don't think you can give it to me right now. I think we all would like him back. But you need drink, food. I can run out and get something, or sun can, or whatever. I'm okay. You sure? Yeah. Um. How are you two doing? Both of you watched it happen. Ah. Uh, Worse for wear. I am at least, uh. I wasn't the closest to Solar, but, you know, he's still family and he helped us yeah. so much. I, uh, I'm doing the best I can, I guess. Kind of hard to say I'm okay or not okay or whatever. I'm not the type of person to really talk about my feelings. Yeah, I know that one at least. Sorry, just... I know. Lunar, I know. how are you exactly? I don't... I don't know. Because you haven't... Out of everyone here, I think... You'd be the closest to, to, to Solar, besides Earth. You, you're kind of having the most odd reaction, I'd say. Yeah. Um, I don't... I don't know. Maybe it just hasn't hit me yet, or something. <sighs> I don't really know how I should react. 
I'm not gonna go try to kill, ruin anything. Did that once with my anger, that didn't help anything. I want to be angry, but my anger won't do anything aside from hurt those around me. I want to cry, but if I cry, then everybody's going to get wet. Or I could do something else with my powers, I don't know. I... I... Don't... I don't feel like I can think straight. I already have everything else that's going on. The mistakes I've made, the stuff I already need to deal with, and then this dropped on top of it immediately after I was ready to start getting better. It's overwhelming. I'm upset, obviously. It's just... a lot. And I know it's okay to express my emotions even with my powers. I just don't want to hurt people. It's okay. People react in their own ways to everything. I'm kind of having a similar reaction to you, I guess. Less because of superpowers, but I'm just trying to fix what I can. See if I can bring him back. I'm doing my best. And, uh... Silent reaction to trauma isn't uncommon. And your description of not being able to think straight isn't uncommon either. Sometimes we just don't know how to process things that happen. Yeah. You, uh... I wouldn't get you anything to chew on or watch TV or, you know, stuff. I I think I'm okay. I, I'd like to try and sleep, but I don't think I can sleep normally. Okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure we have some melatonin gummies around. I know Earth like to use them every now and again. Because they would stay up late to work on something and once the sleepiness hit him. <laughs> That'd be nice. Okay. Um, you can use my room. Don't you need to sleep? I can sleep on the couch. We have three beds. What are you talking about? Yeah, that third bed. I don't think any of us want to be in there. Also, another, like, really comfy couch in the... Oh, right, the lounge. Living room? Uh, no. Lounge room, whatever. Lounge room? I don't know these fancy terms. Uh, you, yeah. if, if you want, Lunar, you can hang out in there. There's plenty of games for you to play to distract yourself. If you don't want to sleep, that's fine. Okay. I'll bring you the gummies in a minute. Why don't you just head up there? Okay. Lunar. Yeah. Everything's gonna be okay, little brother. I'm gonna do what I can. Okay. So, uh... What's the plan? There's a lot of different things I could do. I don't know how many of them will work is the problem. Or can you just... I'm going to do everything I can, but that if I can't bring him... Let just, just, just... What are the chances that we can even get him back? Son, I've already told you I don't want to think about the percentage. Thinking about it in terms of a percentage is only going to be demotivating or crushing. I'm just trying to be... I know. 
I'm trying to be objective. That's normally yeah. a me thing. I'm gonna kind of. I don't know. If you want, you can go spend time with him up there. I'm sure he's probably gonna play something. Sure. Uh, I'm sure you could both use the company. I think I told you, but uh, Eclipse kind of came in and just like rubbed his finger on the floor and then walked out. Yeah, you told me. Um, I don't know if you want to check that out or not. I'll do what I can about it. All right. Look. I gotta try and find him first. Go rest. I'll be okay. Mm-hmm. You mean you're anything else? I don't know. <sighs> it, it, it's, I, I feel like I've ran out of tears to, to, to just. I know what it sounds like. I don't, I don't know what to do, Monty. Yeah, yeah. He was my best friend, and I know, I don't know if you two got along or liked each other, but we, we hung out all the time, and... I know. And, and we had plans today to, to, to go knitting, and we were going to review knitting patterns. We were gonna make some plush dolls together. I was thinking about doing a bunny, and he was thinking about doing like a snake because he thought it was easier. And we were gonna have them be friends. At least I wanted them to be friends. I think he would have gone along with it. Unfortunately, sometimes. Death just kind of happens. Yeah, it does. Unexpected. Unwanted. Needlessly. I'm sorry. I, I wish I could rewind time or something, but... I really wish I could, too. And I'm trying to, you know, get myself together a little bit because I don't want to scare Sun or Moon or Lunar. But, you know, me and Solar talked about it. And my feelings do matter. They do matter. But right now, I just, I don't know. I, I want to I be with all of them, but. You're just upset. You wouldn't know how to process it. God knows I wouldn't know how to either. I didn't, really. I've, I've never had somebody I cared about this much die. Well, it's just kind of... I know. And, like... It just feels like there's this big hole in my chest right now, and it really hurts. And I want to talk about it. But the person I want to talk about it to is gone. He, he would know how to feel, or at least he'd talk to me about it. If I'm feeling okay. It doesn't go away, Earth. It doesn't, yeah. Just... Just something you get used to, sort of. Now there can be some bad days ahead. When... When you're just walking down the street and it just hits you like a tidal wave and other times you practically forget about it. I don't want to forget about it. I know, I know. You're not. You're not. I'd look at it like this because it kind of helped me a little when I was... When my dad died, I, uh... Really angry. Long time. I, uh, I knew it would never go away. No matter what I did. In a weird sort of way. That, that, that's, that pain, it, it's comforting a little. Makes you remember, like, how much you loved them. 
How much it meant to you. How cherishing those memories are going to be. Does that make sense? Yeah, it does. Okay. You want to get you anything? I don't know. Sounds like somebody needs a Frosty. I should try to eat a little. The Frosty sounds You good. want in and out in and out sounds nice. It's Frosty or the in and out You pick. Nope, you pick. in and out I guess. Alright, then I'm gonna get a Frosty. And in and out mm -hmm. Thank you, Monty. I'll be back. Of course. Of course. I hate Ruin. I hate him so much. Why did he have to ruin everything? Ha! Huh, I get his name now. That's really funny. Did you lock yourself out, Monty? Hello, Earth. Would you mind if I came in? Not really. I don't care. Thank you. Appreciate it. This is Montgomery Gator's place. Yeah, what do you want? Actually, it's kind of small. Yeah, it is pretty small. Is there something you need? Because I'm really not in the mind space if you're going to start making fun of me. Ah, because of solar, right? Huh. Tell me something. Do you really need him? Yeah. I know you probably wouldn't understand it because nobody's been that way for you before, have they? In what way? Somebody for you to depend on. Somebody who listens to you and doesn't judge you, and cares really deeply about you. And I'm sorry, you've never had anybody like that. I don't need to depend on anyone. That's a sad life that you can't, but I do. I can depend on my family, but Solar was different. You know, I could talk to Sun and Moon about things. How is he different? Solar was the only one I feel like I could have talked about my Real feelings, too. Son... Son's really good. I, I talk to him about my feelings sometimes, but I don't want to overwhelm him. Moon... He's more logical about things. And Lunar, he has his own issues to deal with. But Solar would put away everything to talk to me. And we spent so much time together. But I really need him. And I'm really sad for you that you've never had anybody like that. Don't be sad for me. I don't need your sympathy. The looks of it, you need it more than I do anyways. I know sympathy isn't your style, though. Yeah, you're right. Just... What would you do to ruin if you had the chance? I don't know. Well, I do know. I'm not violent. I wouldn't hurt him. I would just want to know if he regrets it. And the thing is, I know he probably doesn't. He probably doesn't care that he hurt anybody. I couldn't even look at him right now, I feel. They disgust me so much. 
You wouldn't want to try to kill them. No. I don't need. I don't need to do that. He's a reason Solar is dead. What would killing him do? Make it feel a bit better. No, it would just make me feel like I solved nothing and I just hurt somebody for no reason. <sighs> Look, I'm not like anybody. Like you. Or... I don't know. Whoever else wants to hurt somebody else for revenge. I don't think Solar would want me to do that. I think he'd want me to start knitting again. So I'll just knit again. Even if it really hurts right now. To have nobody to talk to when I do it. Because I could do it with Moon or Sun. Or Lunar. Or Monty. Heck, if you wanted to, I could. But it wouldn't be the same. I'm not a fan of knitting. It wouldn't be the same. Why do you care so much? I was just asking. Okay. I wasn't trying to attack you or anything. <laughs> That's what they all say. I really wasn't. Maybe I should take a bit before I get back into knitting. Then maybe after I eat, I go and I go back to Sun and Moon and Lunar and we can all deal with it together. <clears throat> Bad news. More? In and out is closed. Oh. By the way, Eclipse was here. I don't know if that is a concern what? for you. They did nothing. They just walked around and asked questions. That's all. Did you, did you see his hands going anywhere? Like, what, what was he doing? He literally was just standing talking to me and asking about Solar. What? Don't. don't. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh. It's not a concern. I get the feeling he wasn't here to do any harm. I don't trust him still. Don't think I ever will. That's fair. You have your history with him. I just have a gut feeling. I just thought you should know since this is your house they walked into. Right. You know what? I I'm just going to door dash. Frosty stuff. Want anything Nuggets. else from Wendy's? Nuggets. And fries and sweet and sour sauce. Is that a, is that a reference to South Park? No, I want fries and nuggets and sweet and sour sauce. Why are you laughing at me? I'm already kind of in a bad place right now. I didn't mean to make a reference. Fries. Sweet and sour sauce. Can we watch cat videos for a bit? Oh, I was gonna animal? like to watch a documentary if you wanted to. Okay, sure. Uh, it's like one of those YouTube documentaries for uh, stuff if you want to sit down. I'm gonna just go to DoorDash, like all that stuff you just ask for, okay? Yeah. All right, you, you sit down. Actually, you know what? Pick out whatever video you want to watch. I'll come down in a minute. Okay. Is this smart? I mean, I just ignore it for now. Earth, there's nothing else you can do about it. Yeah, I don't want to sit and be sad and sorry for myself. Solar wouldn't want that. I'll try to make myself feel better until I go back to Sun and Moon and Lunar. Don't force it. Doesn't help. Trust me. Yeah. I'm gonna get that door dash thing now. Okay. That was still really strange with Eclipse, but at least he wasn't mean to me. <laughs>